good afternoon friends this is a series of lecture related to uv visible spectroscopy chapter which is credit based pattern 2019 now similar to previous lecture this lecture also deals with the focus on the detector now detector is nothing but it is a device to measure the intensity of transmitted radiation and convert it into proper signal that is called as a detector so there are different types of the detectors are employed there are different types of the detectors are employed such as photo tube as we have studied already photo tube next one is photo voltaic cell third one is photo multiplier tube and next one is silicon photodiodes so there are four detectors which are employed in colorimeter or spectrophotometer now we will see the photo voltaic cell in today's lecture what is a photo voltaic cell photo voltaic cell is made up of thin film of semiconductor material such as selenium deposited on conducting metal oxide plate such as iron so now photo voltaic cell is constructed from semiconductor material selenium acts as a uh, semiconductor material uh, on which metal oxide plate uh, selenium deposited on uh, semiconductor material such as selenium deposited on conducting metal oxide such as iron now iron is a metal uh, oxide in the form of you can say iron oxide which is a conducting metal oxide of iron now on which surface a semiconductor material selenium is deposited so first layer is uh, iron of before the after that selenium metal oxide is played uh, plated the fe plate acts as a base material base electrode so iron plate acts as a base material while silver or gold film acts as a collector electrode now here so uh, we can say selenium uh, is now we can say first uh, in the in photovoltaic cell it is a uh, construction of photovoltaic cell is nothing but the first selenium plate is there after uh, after that a silver or gold film is coated on the uh, selenium plate and below the selenium plate iron plate is there now the iron plate acts as a collector plate and fe plate acts uh, iron plate acts as a base plate base electrode while silver or gold plate acts as a collector electrode so uh, one uh, out of that the collector electrode is nothing but the anode while base plate that is nothing but the base electrode is nothing but the iron which acts as a cathode when a transmitted beam of light is allowed to pass on it absorption of radiation by semiconducting material selenium promotes the non conducting valence electron to higher energy state which is then collected by silver or gold collector electrode now here as in construction said semiconducting material that is selenium is coated with silver or gold now this silver or gold film acts as a collector electrode when a semi when a uh, when this surface of this semiconductor metal oxide is exposed to the electromagnetic radiation or a transmitted beam of light then what happens non conducting valence electron are produced now the uh, as it is as itself is a semiconducting material it gives the non conducting valence electron this non conducting valence electron goes to the higher energy state in excited state now this higher energy state is unstable also and this high, uh, valence electron non conducting valence electron are get deposited or they get collected to the base to the collector electrode that is silver or gold this produces a hole in semiconductor material so semiconducting material becomes positively charged because it gives rise to the it donates the non conducting valence electron when the non conducting valence electron get uh, given out at that time holes are produced and these holes are observed in semiconducting material the electron from the semiconducting material passes easily to collector electrode now iron is a collector electrode which collects the uh, electrons but there is a moderate resistance to pass electron in reverse direction so this is the most important 
when the electron uh, when the uh, no, non valence uh, when non valence electron passes to towards the collector electrode it get collected but there is a moderate resistance or a resistance is observed to pass the electron in a reverse direction thus migration of migration and creation of holes so simultaneously what happens there is a migration of electron takes place simultaneously there is a creation of holes are observed so this causes a small potential difference between the base and collector electrode which induces a small current in external circuit so due to the potential difference and this potential difference is observed because of the migration of electron and creation of holes so this uh, creation of holes and migration of electron give rise to the potential difference and this potential difference induces a photo current or can say the current in the circuit the current produced is directly proportional to radiant power of incident beam the current produced is directly proportional to radiant power of incident beam so whatever the transmitted light is focused on the uh, semiconducting material that is directly proportional to nothing but the, that is directly proportional to current observed due to the migration of holes and creation uh, migration of electrons and creation of holes the current produced is then amplified and detected as an absorbance or percentage transmittance so that current is nothing but the that current is amplified and detected as a uh, the readout device gives the uh, uh, product uh, pro product in the form of absorbance or percentage transmittance so this is a typical diagram of photo voltaic cell now we can say through the glass plate through the glass plate electromagnetic radiation or we can say transmitted beam of light is uh, incident on this now this is the gold this two lines small two lines indicates the gold or silver film below which semiconducting plate is plate uh, placed this semiconducting uh, plate is there and this black line indicates the iron uh, we can say iron film iron plate now this iron plate is nothing but the black color above which selenium plate is there and above which gold or silver plate is there so this is nothing but the a construction of photovoltaic cell or can the typical diagram for the photovoltaic cell a light a light passes through the gold plate now gold or silver film uh, film uh, 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 here semiconducting uh, semiconductor plate is there which gives the electron uh, and these electrons are collected towards the iron now creation of holes and migration of uh, migration of holes and creation of electrons takes place simultaneously creation of creation of holes uh, takes place simultaneously this will give rise to the uh, okay so small potential difference and that small potential difference is directly, directly proportional to whatever the light amount is uh, is incident on the we can say uh, on the uh, glass through the glass plate so this is all about the this is all about the detector system placed in a uh, photovoltaic so observed but it is nothing but the, it is a construction on the uh, working principle of any detector that is a photovoltaic cell it is a photovoltaic cell uh, in the chapter of uh, ultraviolet visible spectroscopy so basic is that is there in photo in a photovoltaic cell base plate is there uh, then uh, collector electrode is there and uh, uh, and uh, there is a potential difference is observed between them and that potential difference is directly proportional to amount of intensity uh, that is a basic principle and uh, this, that is all about the photovoltaic cell with this content i conclude this lecture thank you very much for patience listening